on how to use your tablet PC. This is Starla with Icon Pareto. In today's edition of Pareto TV, I'm going to be going over some tablet specific programs. We'll start off with Windows Journal Note Writer, move on to Microsoft Office OneNote, and finish it up with Sticky Notes. Journal Note Writer comes standard with all Windows Tablet Edition operating systems. On the last episode, we showed you how to use this program to open and edit an email document and email it back. Today I'm going to be going over the basic features of this program. When we open up a new note, we start out with just a blank notebook page. Using the pen options above, I can choose the size of my pen and an array of colored ink to write directly on my page. I can then click on my selection tool and select a word or group of words. Now I have a few different options. I can go up to Actions, Convert Selection to Email automatically takes the image I have selected and attaches it to an email. Convert Handwriting into Text opens up the text correction box. The program has made its best guess for the word I wrote. If this is not it, I can select the correct word from this box on the right or I can use the input panel to correct it. After clicking OK, I have a choice of copying this text to the clipboard or replace my original handwriting with the text. I'm going to keep it here in journal note. Now, if I would like to change the font of this text, I just highlight my sentence, right click, and select Format Text. Here I can change the font, the font style, and the size. Also, up in my Insert tab, I can insert an extra space between my drawings, a text box, a picture, or a colored flag. Journal Note Writer can also import documents from other programs, which gives you the ability to edit this document in this window and print or email the edited version, like I showed you in our last episode. Microsoft Office OneNote is a great organizational tool for your tablet. This program does not come standard with the tablet PC. OneNote works like a multi-subject paper notebook. First you have your subjects. Inside your subjects you have your sections. And inside your sections you have pages and subpages. Just like Journal Note, you can choose the size and color of your pen. and handwrite on the page. You can change this handwriting into text by clicking on the conversion icon in the top right corner. This program will not ask you to verify the correct interpretation of its conversion, so you can go up to edit and undo if it did not convert correctly. You can also email this note Attach this note to an Outlook task. Insert a to-do or any other tag. You can also clip a part of your screen to insert into OneNote. This lets you take a clip from the last window you were on. I will then click on the clip icon. As you can see, it takes me back to the previous screen and I can select an area I want to be in my note. It then inserts this clipping into my note. From here, I can change the size or move it around in my note. Another great feature is the shared sessions. You can start a shared session with another OneNote user, which can be protected by a password if desired.
When we click on Invite, it opens up an email for us to send out with an attachment that takes the invited straight to the shared session. I can allow them just to watch my screen or I can open it up to be edited by all my attendees. With so many different folders and pages, you can easily find something if you forgot where you saved it. The last thing I want to show you is the search feature. I'll type in the word meeting. The search feature allows you to search all subjects and sections for a word or group of words, handwritten or typed. You can also view a list of these and scroll through the pages with that word. The last thing I'm going to show you today is sticky notes. They are basically a virtual sticky note. You can write your notes and also record a voice note. If you want to copy this note to a document, you can copy and paste or drag and drop into another program or onto your desktop. If you would like more information on how to get your tablet PC, check out our website at iconparado.com for the latest and greatest tablets and technology. And check back soon for more videos on how to use your tablet PC along with other products brought to you by Pareto TV.